the Nebraska Cornhuskers, 11-0, ranked number one in the coalition poll, underdogs. The Florida State Seminoles, 11-1, ranked number two in the coalition poll, a team on a mission. A game that was supposed to be an offensive showcase for FSU turned into a defensive battle. With the game scoreless after one, FSU's offense kicks into gear. Ward goes deep to Knox, and the Seminoles are in UN territory. The Seminoles are close to pay dirt, but a forever blitzing defense forces an early delivery. Scott Bentley comes in to nail the three. UN receiver Reggie Ball receives a gift in the form of a tipped pass. With the first half winding down, the underdog Huskers go up by four. The Big Red defense is unrelenting and keeps FSU out of the end zone. Bentley gets the Seminoles to within one just before the half. Abandoning the I formation, Ward comes out firing. Kevin Knox makes a sensational catch, and the tribe is at the four. William Floyd carries twice and reaches pay dirt. Finally, celebration for the garnered in gold. Bobby Bowden goes for two, but a great defensive effort by Nebraska's Toby Wright ends the play. With the game still up for grabs, William Floyd rips off the most memorable run of the night, barreling and shredding tackles for 34 yards. FSU can't reach the end zone and settles for another Bentley field goal, giving FSU an eight-point advantage. Using a good mix of the pass and run, Nebraska closes to within two. In an effort to tie the game, Osborne goes for it. The Alexanders run Frazier into the ground. A 27-yard field goal puts Tom Osborne just one minute and 16 seconds away from his first national championship. Could destiny be so unkind to Bobby Bowden? Charlie Ward goes to work, hitting Warwick Dunn for nine. William Floyd gets two on the fourth and one, and the green is still alive. Dunn scampers to the Huskers' 33, and a personal foul puts the ball at the 18. On second down, Nebraska defender Toby Wright pulls down McCorby and the tribe has new life. One failed attempt is enough for Bobby Bowden as he calls on the freshman from Colorado. Bentley splits the uprights. With 21 seconds remaining, Nebraska gets one last chance. Trumaine Bell grabs a rope from Tommy Frazier to the 28 as time seemingly runs out. After a premature celebration, one second is put back on the clock. The 45-yard field goal attempt travels wide left. And the celebration begins. The Florida State Seminoles, national champions, at last.